Valley Christian. This is VCTV. I'm Austin. And I'm Marcus. And here's the morning announcements. Tomorrow night at 6.55, there's going to be a lacrosse game against West LA. But come out 10 minutes early to see Ken Amagio sing the national anthem. Also, the first 150 people to be there will be receiving thunder sticks. And each time Valley scores, there's going to be a drawing giving away gift cards. So come out and support. All Model UN students, please come to your meeting today at lunch and bring your required papers. Also, all other students interested in AP art history, as of now, there is no class being offered for next year. However, if you are interested in taking the class, please see Mrs. Odaway as soon as possible. Choir auditions and praise team auditions will be held on May 8th and May 9th, so make sure to sign up soon. Also, if any of you guys are looking for an after-school job during the fall season next year, see Coach Drummond about being the football team manager. This year marks the 65th anniversary of Jackie Robinson breaking the color barrier into Major League Baseball. Here's Gary and Mr. Brass to tell us a little bit more about it. Good morning, Valley Christian High School, and I am here with my fellow colleague, uh, Mr. Brass, uh, one of Valley Christian's finest. And uh, today we're going to be talking a little bit about uh, Jackie Robinson and his significance in the baseball league. But first off, we'd like to get uh, to know Mr. Brass a little bit more. So, uh, Mr. Brass, prior to coaching varsity baseball, what other uh, sports have you been involved with? I've been involved in uh, several sports. I have coached um, boys basketball, girls basketball, cross country, tennis, softball, and in the past I've coached uh, track and field. So I've been involved in a few wow. uh, different athletic events. Uh, a few, I'd say all. <laughs> uh, okay, so let's get down to the reason why we're here. Uh, why is Jackie Robinson so significant this year, especially? Well, this year is the 65th anniversary of uh, Jackie Robinson breaking the color barrier in Major League Baseball, so that's significant. Um, and also, it's obviously more than just a baseball thing, it's kind of a, uh, um, a huge boost for the Civil Rights Movement in 1947. Kind of historically speaking, the civil rights movement had a few things that kind of propelled the civil rights movement, the first being World War II. Uh, the year after World War II, the army was integrated by the President uh, Harry uh, Truman. Um, but 1947 gave kind of a lot of hope and inspiration to a lot of African Americans throughout uh, the country. Um, and it really wasn't until 1954 with a um, landmark Supreme Court case called the Brown versus Board of Education decision that basically integrated um, schools uh, throughout the country that the law kind of got on the side of um, for the civil rights movement for African Americans but Jackie Robinson his major role I think was to kind of let people see that um, an African American can integrate very smoothly into basically a world that had been pretty much all Caucasian and I think he inspired a lot of people. Thanks, Gary, for that interview. Congrats to boys varsity volleyball for finishing in second place in league and to softball and baseball for currently holding first place with big games this Friday and next week. Just a reminder, don't forget tomorrow is service day, so come ready to work and dress appropriately. And also, if you're going with Mrs. Cortez on May 25th to Grace Children's Home, don't forget to bring your $30. For the full interview of Mr. Brass, check out our website. Once again, I'm Marcus. And I'm Austin. And this is VCTV, signing off. Uh, 1981. 1981, that was the Dodgers over the Yankees. Uh, 2005. 2005, that was the White Sox over the Houston Astros. 